Let's say we want to compute 39 squared minus 11 squared in our head, obviously, no calculator. One option, of course, is maybe you've memorized the first 40 perfect squares like I have. Yes, I'm a huge hit at parties. 39 squared is 1521, 11 squared is 121, and 1521 minus 121 is 1400. But that's a suspiciously nice answer. What's going on here that we can get a difference of 1400 between these two perfect squares? That is, in fact, precisely the key. This is a difference, a minus minus sign separating two perfect squares, and when that happens, you can use something called the difference of two squares factoring pattern. This must be the same thing as the difference between the two roots, 39 minus 11, times the sum of the two roots, 39 plus 11. 39 minus 11 is 28, 39 plus 11 is 50, and now we can see where that nice calculation is coming from. 28 times 50 we can compute in a variety of ways. My personal favorite is something called the double and half trick, and 14 times 100 is indeed 1400.